Hey there, it's Dr. Crypto here, and I hope everybody's having a fantastic weekend. I thought I'd do this very quick video on Bitcoin and Crypto.com and Kronos because it's getting more and more important as days goes on. The bulls and the bears are fighting away at the moment, and we're starting to see Bitcoin create structure, which could be meaning that we're going to break out at some point, and either it's going to be to the upside or it's going to be to the downside. My personal opinion is I think it's possibly more likely that we're going to go to the upside, but I could be wrong on that i've been wrong before and i'll probably be wrong again at some point but at the moment we can see here on this one daily chart that we're creating a systematical triangle here and basically we've got a lot of resistance as you can see around these areas here but we've also created support around here and as we're going along it's starting to get tighter and tighter and tighter now if we to break out at some point then obviously we could go up to around about that $88,000 mark. And obviously to the breakdown to the downside will take us around about that fifty-three dollars to $55,000 mark. But what I am also looking at here is that we've got the Bitcoin halving on the April the 20th. Now coming on the end of this systematical triangle where the pressure is starting to build, that is where the halving is as it's coming close towards the end of the systematical triangle. But if we also look at the Bollinger Bands as well, and we can see here we're just basically in this basically this tunnel at the moment just chopping around that sideways creating structure and we can see here what happened here we got that same kind of sideways and then we broke up to the upside sideways broke to the upside again sideways and then we broke down to the downside and then obviously we've got more sideways action here upside sideways upside sideways upside is this going to repeat itself by going sideways and then push to the upside now obviously bitcoin makes its big moves to the upside that's obviously going to make big moves uh, for the altcoins as well and as we can see here on the weekly we have got the brazy price action concepts here uh, and also we've also got the signal overlay here uh, which you can see here on the smart trail is basically perfectly moving to the upside we haven't lost any kind of structure on the weekly at all We've basically smoothly made our way up. We've got a beautiful buy signal here, which has pushed us up to. Now we've got three crosses here, which is potential for reversal, but this doesn't always, obviously always plays out. So we just got to bear that one in mind. But obviously, you know, as for anything that you get big moves to the upside, you can get big moves to the downside. I'm not. I'm personally think I'm bullish on Bitcoin, and I personally think we're going to make moves to the upside. Let me know in the comments what do you think is going to happen as well and we can see on the bounty bubbles here it's on the this is on the weekly it's a lot of coins are down we've got the odd one like core not too sure what that is that's up 100 over 100 percent ena not too sure what that is that's up 88 percent but we look on the the two day on the today's uh, a lot of green starting to happen on the hourly bit of a mixed bag so we just got better in mind we've also one thing i am watching also is whale alert getting a lot of like uh these are a lot of billion dollar usd uh, transfers buys uh are coming in so as more and more they come in what to me the bear market starts to kick in when you start seeing this less and less and obviously to me we're getting quite a few of these coming in start quite regular as well uh, and also we could say mr crypto says here uh, as you can see here perfectly buys this is in the bull market buy 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 as we're dropping down we get these beautiful buys drop down we get this buy signal and drop down we get this buy signal and this is happening again we've got that drop down so we're going to get a buy signal and make our way up to the upside and you can see this and you can see here on his twitter he's perfectly put this out trading bitcoin in the bull market is easy if you know this strategy you can time every bottom perfectly with a 99 percent accuracy there is basically one indicator you need to have a look at show more and he said this is the ultimate bull market strategy and he's got like i said i just showed you here what that is but also we can see here we've also started to get inflows coming in again we sort of got that negative it started to reduce because grayscale was selling as well but they're starting to get stronger and stronger and stronger so uh of 203 million was of yesterday on the friday by blackrock and we saw the news about other banks starting to fomo in again which is mega bullish and don't forget like on april 20th roughly 13 days time we're going to get that bitcoin halving now when we get that bitcoin halving this could be a choppy sideways action all the way to there maybe in between from now up till the halving we might get another dip but we might might start making our way up 
But obviously, we could get to here, go keep on going sideways, and then make a strong move to the upside. A mega bullish on Bitcoin. So let's go and check out what's happening with CRO. So look at it, CRO at the moment. On the day, we're down around about 6%. And we can see here, again, just like Bitcoin, we're creating that systematical triangle here where we've tested now a couple of times here on support. We've also tested here a few times now on resistance. So obviously, depending on what Bitcoin does in the near future, then obviously this is going to mark the, the ways for the altcoins as well, as well as CRO. And obviously what's happened is we've had this beautiful impulse wave to the upside. We've come back down, tested support, come back up, testing resistance and basically we're just like chopping sideways exactly like bitcoin at the moment but we can see on the weekly chart as well we can see here on the weekly we have that bear market where we come down there's big drops down there but look at that we're starting to make our way up here we've also got that uh, basically we've got the uh, price uh, signal overlays here which is turned blue now on the weekly so obviously that's starting to get the trend is your friend until the very end well the trend was here on the bear market was down and we're just starting to turn the trend in the bull market to the upside and it's only just beginning so you as i said don't look at the five minute don't look at the one minutes don't look at the five minutes don't look at the half an hour or the hours if you're here looking like me looking at the long term look at the weekly look at the daily see what's going on and that's what i do and look at that when you zoom out we've only just started the bull market in terms of cro we've got a long way to go and my target is to get to that dollar to get that two dollars and get to that three dollars which i do personally think will happen over the bull market and if people say you know i might be wrong i've got to bear that one in mind got to be wrong on that might be wrong on that i might be right on that and i, I want to put it out there also i do own a nice white and i am biased because i own cro as well but i just want to put it out there as well but like i said don't put more money you're willing to lose always have a plan that's all i say i always uh, say that normally at the beginning but i didn't but i have now anyway yeah going on to the cro looking pretty strong at the moment on the weekly looking pretty good and i'm not surprised because a lot of things are going on and like i said my target is two dollars fifty to three dollars people say that like i said people say it's not going to happen to that they don't know nobody knows nobody knows the future nobody's got a crystal ball but people said that to me when I bought ADA at seven cents. And I keep mentioning this because people were saying to me, it's not going anywhere. It's not doing anything. Then ADA went to $3.10. So you just got to bear that one in mind. Ignore the four days out there. Do your own research. You can't go wrong that way. But, you know, overall, it's looking pretty decent for CRO. We get pulled. As I say, you get these big moves up. You're going to get pullbacks. That's the way the market works. Uh, and we can see here, you know, like a bullish on CRO, you got things like C uh, South Korea that's happening. And also, for me, one thing I am pointing out, I have put some of my CRO to get some more of that Corgi AI. So a 10x booster here, 100,000 allocation. I put my some of my CRO into that charger. Why not? We're going sideways. Nothing's really happening. I'm not going to be selling any CRO soon. So obviously, I'm just trying to accumulate various coins on my supercharger. So supercharger has just started. It's worth just checking it out. Uh, now you can deposit CRO in a pool to earn Kronos Exo tokens as a reward. Reward put 100,000 for Corgi AI, which is, you know, if you wanted to do that, it's up to you. Uh, for me, I might as well. Uh, and also, not forgetting, don't forget, you've got the welcome pack now for the Apple and Samsung gear. Time is running out for that. If you want to get into your crypto.com card, here's the tiers here. Or you have to go to crypto.com uh, slash cards, and it will bring you up and it will give you all the information about the reward. You know, for me, for 350 euros, you get 1%. You know, just like I say, pay for a holiday or you go shopping or something like that, you get 1% back. It's always worth it. I've got the icy white, like I say, I get 3% back. I use it all the time when I'm going to get a coffee or go shopping or going to purchase or go on holiday uh, or, you know, if I want to buy some goods from a, from a, like a, a Curry's a te te techno store or something like that, you know. So I use it for everything and I've also got Spotify, Netflix and I've also got Prime as well. So just bear that in mind. It's always worth having, in my opinion. It's up to you. Do your own research on that. But overall, see our, the crypto market in general. Mega bullish on that. Mega bullish on Bitcoin. Lots of things going on. So, like I say, give us a like and give a subscribe. It's always much appreciated. And I'll see you probably next week. So have a great weekend. Take care and I'll see you soon.